Step 1. Plan the decision tree model. Before diving into precision tree, it is useful to think carefully about the sequence of decisions and uncertain outcomes as they will unfold through time. Just remember three basic conventions of decision trees. Number one, time flows from left to right. Events to the right occur after events to their left. Number two, decisions are made at decision nodes, represented by squares. The branches that emanate from any decision node represent all the possible choices the decision maker has at that point in time. Number three, uncertain outcomes occur at chance nodes, represented by circles. The branches that emanate from any chance node represent all outcomes that could occur at that point in time, and their probabilities must sum to one. In the example model, where a company must decide whether to bid, and if so, how much to bid, for a government contract in the face of potential competing bids, the sequence of events is the following. Number one, the company decides whether to place a bid, a decision node. Number two, if the company decides to place a bid, the company decides how much to bid, a decision node. Number three, if the company bids, it then sees whether there are any competing bids, a chance node. Finally, number four, if there are any competing bids, the company sees whether it has underbid the competitors, a chance node. Of course, there are monetary consequences for certain events. If the company decides to bid, it must pay for preparing the bid. This is shown as a negative number because it is a cost. If the company eventually wins the bid, it receives the bid amount minus the cost of completing the project. You are looking at the completed tree in Precision Tree, and you will be building it from scratch shortly. For now, focus on the sequence of events from left to right. Notice that the structure of the tree following any bid amount is the same as that shown for the top bid amount. This should make you think of copying parts of the tree to save time. As you will see, Precision Tree enables you to do exactly this. Now it's your turn. Stop this video and take a few moments to review the completed decision tree in the spreadsheet. Also, look at the given probabilities in cells C12 and C16 to C19, and check how they lead through Excel formulas to the probabilities of the company winning the bid in cells F16 to F18. You see these latter probabilities in the rightmost branches of the tree.